Hey guys, what's up? Al here from Alan M Gaming, and today we're going to be looking at Zahar's second informed version card. We're going to pick him up for 120,000 coins. I expect his price to drop to around 100,000 coins uh, in the upcoming weeks. Let's just have a quick look at his baseline stats. He's got 94 pace, 91 dribbling, 80 free shot, and 80 physical. Let's have a look at his attribute details. He's got 92 acceleration, 94 sprint speed, 86 attack positioning, 86 finishing, uh, 86 uh, crossing. I don't know why I said that one. It doesn't really matter. I'm really impressed with his uh, dribbling stats. He looks to be insane. I imagine he's going to be really good on the ball. 94 agility, uh, 91 ball, ball control, and 93 dribbling with 86 stamina and 81 strength. Haven't played with Zaha before. Um, so I'm looking forward to giving him, giving him a go and seeing what he's like. He's also got three star weak foot and four star skills. So before not, let's go on and get into the in-game highlights of what he's actually like. Okay, guys. So overall, I was really impressed with this card, and I would say he was worth the hundred to hundred and twenty thousand coins that I picked him up for. He's an all-round good striker, and I'd consider playing him ahead of like Son, Aguero, players like that. Uh, I do really rate him at all. Maybe the only downside, but we'll get into that after, is he's a uh, he's three star weak foot. Maybe that lets him down uh, slightly, but I really like his 86 attack position. That's high enough. It's not the highest, uh, but I believe it should be a bit higher to be fair uh, from these clips because he's always in the right place at the right time. Bit of a lucky goal there uh, from Zaha, but I say his 86 attack position puts him. Uh, in the right position for me to get that lucky goal into the back of the net. Uh, I can't remember these highlights. I say I am uploading this video a bit late uh, because I've been out all weekend doing whatnot with other commitments. But Zaha gets in the right place at the right time and he speeds me into the bottom left hand corner. These highlights were played in the daily knockout, which I did go on to win to qualify for the weekend league and online seat on online season. So I was playing in Division Two. I can't quite handle it, 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 Division 1, can't win it uh, very often, I, I come across really tough opponents, um, but nice um, nice shot there into the top left hand corner, I do believe uh, his long shot should have been a bit higher than what they were, I think he's only got 72 long shots, I did feel like that was a bit higher, I think you're just about to see him a, a, a bang a long shot into the top left hand corner, yes you are, that is a fantastic finish from Zaha, and especially on his right foot, that's going to fly uh, into the back out of the net, nine times out of ten, uh, I would say. Went for another long shot with Zaha, but it falls to Lukaku. I'm going to pass it out wide to Costa, and with his 86 attack positioning, Zaha is there to put it into the back of the net. His uh, uh, jumping and heading accuracy is a downside. You know, he's only got 55 jumping and 52 uh, heading accuracy, so he's not going to score many headers for you. Uh, but if you can get him a clear shot on goal, you know, and he, he will win the header, you know, is it going to be powerful enough, you know, that's for you to uh, to determine. This nice build-up play from Son. Fien Zaha, nice LBNA passes to try and get him in behind. Zaha's making that forward run, and he gets in the right position at the right time with that 94 pace and 92 acceleration to put that into the back of the net. I think I've got a few more highlights for you here, guys. I think I scored about uh, 12 goals with him. I played about 8-9 games with him, so not a bad uh, return and a nice long shot into the bottom left-hand corner there from Zaha. Straight off kickoff. Kickoff is OP, they really need to patch it, and it is broken. In the same game, Zaha goes on to bag me a brace. I do really like this card, guys. I say I would play him above uh, my informed song card that I've got. Maybe thinking about in selling that informed song card uh, to play Zaha more regularly. Straight from kickoff, this is the kickoff glitch. I don't know if I've come up with it. I don't see many other people using it. Uh, but Zaha in the right position at the right time. Takes that touch with the 91 ball control and 93 dribbling and slots it into the bottom left hand corner guys. His dribbling is absolutely insane. I think that's the best thing uh, about his card that I came up with. Uh, I believe he should have 5 star skills. I believe he's an absolute a baller in real life. He should have 5 star instead of 4 star. I think EA have made a little bit of a mistake there. And one more long shot to add to the collection. So let's get into his pros and cons. I've already gone through most of them. The 94 sprint speed and 92 acceleration. I hope you can see uh, those stats come to fruition for the hearts, what you've just seen. And his 87 shot power uh, from his 72 long shots, you could see there as well. I really liked his agility, ball control, and dribbling. It's really close control with the ball. And also, his four soft skills are a con, or a pro. Sorry, I think he probably should have five. The only cons I came up with, obviously, are his passing. He's not a passer, he's a striker. Uh, he's not a midfielder, so his passing is slightly poor. He's 55 jumping and 52 heading accuracy and he's 3 star weak foot guys. But I wouldn't put that off 
uh, getting him, I give him an overall value of 9 out of 10. And for the volume of coins, I give him a 9.5 out of 10. I really would recommend giving him a go. I uh, haven't compared it to his first in fun card. I didn't play with it. So this is the first time I played with him, and I was really impressed. So if you want to see more videos like this of more informed cards, then be sure to like and subscribe. But for now, this is Al signing out from Alan M Gaming, and I'll see you in the next video.